The third Shanghai Private Label Fair was held at Shanghai Mart from the 12th to the 14th of December 2012. With support from the Shanghai Municipal Commission of Commerce, the fair was co-organized by the Private Label Manufacturers Association and the Shanghai International Sourcing Promotion Center Limited. The fair attracted 229 companies from 19 countries and regions. The fair, covering an area of more than 10,000 square meters, received 7,205 visitors. Among them were 2,000 professional buyers, a 48% increase over that of last year. The Shanghai Fair aims at better means of domestic retailing, closer links between manufacturers and retailers, and broader access to market channels. The fair also seeks closer cooperation between home and overseas manufacturers and to facilitate sound growth of Chinese private labels. Private label products developed rapidly during the years 2010 to 2012. The number of exhibitors this year increased by nearly 50% and the visitors came from 31 countries and regions, including Denmark, Germany, Poland, France, Switzerland, Italy, Spain, USA and North Korea. The exhibits at the fair covered such categories as foodstuffs, personal care materials and daily use articles. At the fair, the buyers and suppliers communicated well and agreed to numerous intentions of cooperation. The success of the fair promises a sound development of private labels in Asia. As in previous years, Idea Supermarket at the fair displayed private labels from 25 domestic and overseas retailers from 13 countries. On display were the most up-to-date development trends and management principles for supermarkets that were particularly helpful for new startup businesses. The 2012 fair saw more retailers attend. Five leading domestic retailers, Tesco, Offa, Staples, China Resources Vanguard and U.S. Sing Furniture joined the fair for the first time. They displayed their private labels to share experiences with their counterparts and seek closer ties with quality manufacturers. A retailer training luncheon was held during the fair. Brian Sheroff and Tim Simmon, respectively Chairman and Vice Chairman of the PLMA, gave lectures briefing attendees on the private label situation and the latest trends in the retail sector in Europe and the United States. At the training course, Yao Zheng, Deputy General Manager of Shanghai International Sourcing Promotion Center Company Limited, suggested the founding and operation of an institution for the promotion of local private labels. The motion received a very positive response. 2012 Shanghai Private Label Fair also received media attention. Scores of media outlets such as China News Service, Jiefang Daily, Wenhui Daily, Shanghai Commerce, Labor Daily, China Business News, Shanghai Daily, ICS, and websites such as China Economy, Xinmin, Retailers, and China Commerce Supermarket Weekly all gave continued coverage. Jiefang Daily published the comment, Private labels have gradually gained market favor. Labor Daily's commentary was, Private labels start to be welcomed, while Shanghai Daily issued an article entitled, Private labels see room for growth in China. Both participating manufacturers and retailers expressed their appreciation for the positive effects the fair had on companies and the market. They also aired active suggestions on further development of the fair. 现在很多超市爱国的超市游戏是已经超过有三百三十以上都是几个品牌的目前全球的这个超市做贴牌的这个趋势越来越明显所以我们中国中国这个贴牌展来讲我们是非常看好因为毕竟中国在亚洲也好
这个行业里边的一些人都会认识到我们公司了。啊，你们这个展览呢很有针对性，规模和规格是相当比较高的。基本上都是这个把 OEM 的厂商跟这个欧这个推自主品牌的这个零售商结合在一起嘛，所以我想大家这个开发自有品牌跟推广自有品牌的心态上面都是比较一致的。呃，中国的这个 PMA 非常正规，就是因为我作为我个人来讲，我参加过国际上很多的展会，但是就是说咱们从呃，参展从参观商这个管理这一块啊，就是说非常严格的，不像国内的呃其他的一些展会呢，就是人员比较杂，这个还是非常专业的，我们非常欣赏。我们的同行，比方说在武汉的那个吉利啊，他们也是参加过很多次，所以说相对来说那个呃，他们带我们给我们推荐的这个展会啊，所以说非常感谢主办方。我们还计划明年继续参展。I think they are learning what the private label is all about. Um, I think it's just going to take a little bit more time, but right now, I can tell you we probably did get some good deals here at this show, uh, and that's good success for us. It's actually our first show here. We think it's very well organized. We feel very good here, and uh, the people are extremely friendly. I think uh, it's a good way to promote the products here for the first time. During the three-year running of the private label Fair Asia, the fair has seen steady growth in professional services. It is a very effective exchange platform for the development of private labels. The 2013 fair is scheduled to be held at the Shanghai International Sourcing Center. Let's meet in Shanghai in 2013.